Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hi, this is Ghufran. In this video, you will learn how to make a fish shark game in Scratch 3.0. So let's start. I need two sprites and I need a backdrop. So I don't need this sprite, so delete this sprite. And how to add a backdrop, so choose a backdrop. So search it underwater. That's great. Choose underwater backdrop. Okay, what I need, I need a sprite called fish. So how to add it? Choose a sprite and search it fish. Type fish. So that's great. Choose this sprite. So reduce its size to 70. Okay. Now I need 10 copies of this sprite. So how to do it? Let's start. Click on events. I need 10 copies so I will repeat 10 times in create clone of myself so it will create 10 copies let's try go that's great 10 copies have been made what I need I need 10 copies but in a random position so add this block that's great 10 copies have been made what I need I need a next costume this sprite have four costumes so flag click four costumes have been made that's great okay whenever uh, the copies have been made so move these sprites so for this click on control when i start as a clone that's great forever move this clone into four three steps that's great okay but the original sprite has not been moving so for this i will hide this original sprite so how to do it looks show and hide it that's great all the 10 sprites 10 copies are moving so uh, it's arrived into the edge of the stage for this i will add a block called F1H bounce into this area. That's great. And I need a set rotation style left right. So it will move, it will be moving into the left right. If you press R around and if you need left right, that's great. Okay. For make it more real, I'm, I'm adding a ton, another ton only for three degrees so it's been more real okay so what i need i need another sprite choose sprite shark okay click on this that's great reduce the size to 70 okay what I need, I need whenever I pressed up arrow, it will move into the up direction. When, whenever I press down arrow, it will move into the down direction. Whenever I press right arrow, it will be moved to the right arrow. So for this, click on flag clicked, foreverly check. And if, if the right arrow pressed, right key pressed, choose the option right arrow so point in direction 90 and change x by 5 that's great now same is the case for left arrow but the only options left arrow and change y by minus 5 and point in direction into the left side that's great now duplicate it duplicate it make it for up point in direction up in this case i will add a change y by five and whenever i press down arrow point in direction change y by minus five so try it that's great it's moving moving but it's moving in all around what I need, I need a set rotation style, left, right. That's great. 
so it's moving into the left right direction only what if you want to make it more real so click on events drag this block control block forever in changes costume after point control after point five second point five second that's great shark has been changing his costume after point five seconds so our final steps for this to whenever the clone have touched to the shark so delete this clone so click on fish and check it f condition whenever this clone has been touched to the shark so sensing drag this block into this area whenever this clone touching to the shark so delete this clone that's great now if you want to make another option that is score if you want to add a score option for this you will click on make variables make a variable score and press ok that's great whenever I click flagged so the set score to 0 and whenever it touches to this fish shark so change score by change score by 1 let's try make it full screen that's great it's more interesting i hope you will like this video and please subscribe our channel